This conference will now be recorded. Okay. So, right. Last class, we've been talking about one minute. Last class, we have been talking about sales cloud. We have seen how to create an order, right? How to activate an order. For an order, we have seen that a contract is required, right? We have seen that we don't have any by default conversion to invoice out of box Salesforce. It requires a Salesforce CPQ software, or also called as Salesforce billing which you have to buy with an additional licenses, right? Which is not out of box available. Now, however, these features can be developed. We have also seen that uh, these features can be developed by the development team. That means your role. We can go ahead and we can create the logistics. We can go ahead and we can develop the whole CPQ, the or in other words, the order and invoice or billing system can be done. Now today, we will go ahead and we will see the service module, the last module of your consulting subject. So today we will close the consulting, the end user work, and tomorrow onwards we will start your admin work, your core admin work, the work which you have to perform in the real time, right? So let's go ahead, put a heading called as service cloud, service cloud. Service cloud. What is a service? Any post sale inquiry, any post sale inquiry is called service. Any post sale inquiry is called service. So after the sales is over, anything the customer calls for, where is my status? Where is my uh, product, right? Uh, plus, right, any type of complaint about the product, returns, warranty, anything. After the sales is over, any inquiry that comes to the business is called service, is called service, right? Is called service. Now, next line. Service cloud consists of following elements. Number one, cases. Cases. First one, case or cases. Second one, solution. Second one, solution. Bracket classic. Bracket classic. Bracket classic. And the third one called contract, bracket optional, bracket optional, need customization, bracket optional, need customization. After that, also known as warranty, right? Also called as warranty. Now let's go ahead and see how does this work? I will log in with my credentials, Rupam, right? At the rate of101.com, password CRM1234 hash. I'm logging to the Salesforce. I after it logs in, I click on App Manager. I go to the Service Cloud module. I click on Service. It takes me to the Service module. It takes me to the Service module. Right? It takes me to the Service module. On the top, you can see that Chatter, Accounts, Contacts, Cases. I click on Cases. See, you are not able to see solution because solution is a part of classic, not is a part of lightning yet. Very soon, 
solution will also be part of lightning it will come soon in the next release you'll be able to see solution here currently we have only cases i will click on new case i can i can go and register a case right what is the status new what is the priority hi what is the case origin by phone who is calling saif ali khan is calling scroll down right what is the reason mechanical electrical your work is to change all these and put it as per the client requirement if it's airtel you will say recharge problem data problem right network problem something like this as soon as you select this the next should show right rc555 if it's a recharge rc555 rc777 right something like this so i will say it's it's what installation problem out of box salesforce is for a generator company so that's the reason you are able to see all hardware installation breakdown performance i will say feedback web email right now if you see that most of the company whenever you go to their home page any company you see that there is option called contact us where you can fill a form right for example let me go to the hyderabad metro rail i'm going to the hyderabad metro rail website right hyderabad metro rail if you have any complaints regarding the hyderabad metro rail any staff not behaving properly any type of feedback you can click on contact us form right and right contact us oh it's do you have any complaint okay it's giving you an email okay do you have any any other form right okay let me go back let me see you might have observed this right hyderabad metro rail what is this okay let me go to this hmr metro rail here it will be there most of the website when you click on contact us there's a form that comes in name phone email address or description about your complaint right what exactly you want to complain so you can write and automatically the system will create a email and send to the respective team right respective team right hyderabad metro rail do you see about us no home right not able to find but you know this what exactly i'm talking about most of you knows this right anything here called contact us about us no i don't see any contact us okay here it is let's see whether it gives me a form or not i randomly picked up something right most of the time when you go to any company's home page right all of you know exactly what i'm talking about when you click on contact us you get a form to fill where you can type your problem and automatically when you click on it save here we'll be learning how from a web page the cases will come here whatever the web company web email what is the web email what he entered in the web what are the details that he entered in the web web phone web web phone web name web company right let me check for the last time if it's there right no i don't get it's only a mail right anyone knows any website where you have a contactors and it gives you a form anything anyone quickly right contactors will give you a form app will it there be in apollo hospital i believe everyone understood what exactly i'm talking about yes or no when you click on contactors did anybody yes, fill that yes we get it sometimes yeah the complaints right it, it will be there sometimes you know let's say give your feedback okay something like this let's see so whenever you click on contactors and give your feedback it will give you an form based input right something like this here we go we have it your name your last name your email address your contact number and some choices which city are you in what is your feedback and click on submit automatically a case will be raised in the system salesforce system case what is the web email he entered what is the company name he has entered what is the phone he has entered right all these details will be pulled automatically from the web how to do this we will see later currently this all fields are not that important for us 
for this we need to have a home page right a product a company home page we need to do some development or we have to develop the page we have to do some development pass it to the case it requires programming now about the product you can see that which product this complaint is regard our product is not listed that means we have to still map our product what is the sequence number of our product right any type of sla violation yes or no any agreement violation no right any potential liability yes if company is taking the complete responsibility of the product because it is within the warranty what is the product it's gc1040 let's take an example it's not a compulsory field i'm still filling it you have to customize all these what is the what is the case lenovo phone lenovo tab not working this is what the customer is complaining lenovo tab not working customer says received a new tab right tried tried to switch on switch on not working connected to the power connected to charger not working so customer is calling and he, these are the comments what you try to do what are the internal comments internal comments i can say that well okay tried different charger different available charger charger right available charger no go reset the battery reset the battery no go so you try to reset the battery but it was still not working right i tried with some other charger but still the phone is not charging it's not turning on looks like we require more right i might not be able to handle it also okay uh, hey uh, saif ali uh, hi saif i'm going to you know register a case and my technical team will get back to you there an option called as send notification to the email contact i click on save immediately a case is been registered case number 1026 1026 is the case number this is the email that has gone to the saif ali khan hi dear saif ali thanks for contacting us with your inquiry your reference number for the case is 1026 the subject of your case is lenovo tap not working we look forward to speaking with you soon rupam right here abc technology can i change this email yes we will do that currently this is what that's gone i can see the details here complete details i have registered see whatever you have captured it is here right now you can go to the call logs right any type of call logs who is calling what is not happening right you can go ahead to the related and you can start updating the case comments then one of another people another employee call the customer so he will register his comment call call the customer cus call the cust tried blah 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 whatever he tried to do everything has been registered here guys so that two minutes after that again i call back the customer and i try to do something right one email was sent one case comments if you are doing any type of right call history right who created it what you are doing everything has been registered here right everything right this is how the call center people will work this is how the call center people will work right this is how the call center people will work they can go ahead and they can create a new task so that activities only new event right new task new event they can go they can say new task what type of task it is system will ask right so subject everything they can say it's call right due date i have to call the customer by tomorrow and update the status status update status update saif ali khan so not started we have to update the status to the customer by 95 
by fifth of this month, we have to update the status to the customer. All these are end user work, right? This is how the current end user will start working, right? Any type of pictures he has shared, you can go ahead and upload it, right? All these. You can go ahead and you can you can you can post, guys. Can anyone help with a new M tab, right? You can do that. You can post comments, right? So that other people can see, other people in the sense within your company can see and they can start helping you. Yeah, even I had the same problem last month. One customer calling, you know, I just removed the battery, clean the pin, and then you know press the power button for two seconds and then connected the battery back and then started the phone as normal, it started. Somebody gave this step. I can go ahead and I can try this step. So you can post, you can poll. Guys, will this step will work? Choice one, yes, no, right? So all these, what will happen? It will be done by the end user. Right, case by the end user. Now, how to resolve it? Same thing, let me go ahead and switch to classic and show you. Switch to classic. There also we are in, right, I will change, I'll go to the service. Now here also you can see that case and solution. In Lightning you don't see solution, here you see solution. So I click on case, right, the same case I'm opening, 1026, Lenovo phone not working, or Lenovo tab not working. I click on details and I can see, right, what are the open activities, what are the histories, what are the case comments, who is doing what in this case. All these can be seen here. I can click on close case when the case is closed. But now the case is not resolved, right? We tried. You know, I tried so many steps, but it's not resolved, right? What I'll do, I will tell the customer, hey, can I put you on hold for two minutes so that I can pull some documents? In between, I will go ahead and I will try to find some solutions, some documents in my system. Where do you think they will find? Do you think that they will go to Google and search? No, no. Lenovo company or they have their own database of problems, resolutions, because it's their product. They knows about their product well, how this product is working, what are the defects of this products and everything. Hence, what will happen is that they will be searching a solution. Write down next heading solution. Subheading solution. Solution. Resolution, write down. Resolution to a problem. Resolution to a problem or case is called solution. Resolution to a problem or case is called solution. Resolution to a problem or a case is called solution. When you call Airtel, right? Call center. You come up with your own problem. Airtel call center agent is receiving 100 to 200 calls, one one agent every day. Every customer is calling with different different problem issues. Do you think that the person who is taking the call, the service center agent is God? He knows answer to all the questions? No, definitely not. He will ask you that can I put you on hold for two minutes so that I can pull some documents? Where he's pulling the document? He is going to pull the documents from solution. Solution is the place where all the internal issues of a product is maintained here. We also call them as knowledge base. This is also called as KB, KB articles. In real time projects, People also refer as KB articles. KB articles, knowledge base articles. We call them as knowledge base articles. For example, I'm in solution now. I'm in solution. I click on the new button. New. I click on the new button. 
I give a title called as no power. And I say, try the steps. Try blah, blah, blah. Zero two. Try the step. Zero three. Right? Whatever the document is. Try this. I will click on save. One document got created in my system. The document ID is 11. 11. I can go ahead and attach a video file, right? Choose. I can go ahead and attach a PDF copy with a diagram step by step. So suppose somebody says, hey, I don't know how to open the uh, battery. So every model might have a different way of opening the battery. Those diagrams, I can go ahead and I can attach here. Those diagrams, videos, you can go ahead in the real time, we attach here. For example, I'm just attaching one PDF. Attach. Done. You can attach videos, you can attach, right? PDF, PPTs, step by step. What is this knowledge article? No power. Only admin can approve it. Creation of knowledge article can be done by any user. But if you create it, other user cannot see it unless and until admin approves it. Where is, the, where is the approval? Click on edit. Change the status from draft to review. This status change is available only to admin guys. This status change is available only to admin. Right? There are two, two checkboxes. Public. View in public knowledge base. That knowledge base, KB. People also call them as KB. What is the knowledge base? Right? Whenever you go to a Flickart or anywhere, you say that contact us. Flickart directly don't give you the phone numbers or to contact by chat or email. First, they will give, what is the problem? My order is delayed. You'll get a lot of choice. You'll select a choice. My order is delayed. Immediately, it'll give you some information. Okay, try the steps. Try the steps. If your order is delayed, go here, go here, find the wavel number. Click on tracking, you will know the status. You need not to talk to our call center agent for this. You can do it by yourself. We call them as knowledge base articles. Self service. Customer self service documentations are called as knowledge base. Customer doesn't know how to check the status. He wants to contact call center. Before calling the call center, right? What is your problem? I want to know my status. Immediately, it will give you some knowledge articles. Click here. Did this link help you? Yes, no, no. Then you'll say, okay, contact us on this number. So that all this we can build, right? Visible in public knowledge base. Whatever the document that I'm writing, I can export this in my company web page, company homepage. If I'm Apollo Hospital, then I can host this documents in Apollo Hospital. Information will go from here in the Apollo Hospital, right? Available for public, right? That means customer says, hey, I'm not in front of my system. Can you please send me those steps by email? You can send this document through email, right? These are the two checkboxes. I make the status review. I click on save. One solution got created. Once again, I'm doing for the second time. I click on solution. I click on the new button, right? I go ahead and I say, right? No power, no display. Earlier one, I created no power. So now, what do you want to do? You write a big paragraph, uh, do this, do this, do this. Some important steps, save. Go ahead and attach a video or an text file or a PPT file or an image file, right? Once it's done, edit. I will change from draft to reviewed. This particular document is only internal. I don't want it in public, so I'm not checking those two boxes. Click on save. Again, I'm creating third solution. Click on new. You can see that 11, 12, 13. What is that? I will say no, right? No power, no power, no display, no, no response. No response on 
L-E-N-O-V-O, Lenovo Tab. To resolve this problem, do this, do this, do this, do this, do this, do this. Something, something. I click on save. See that? I'm not changing it to review status. I'm keeping in draft status. Total, how many solution I have in my system? Three. Three. Two are in review, one is in draft. Two is in review, one is in draft. Now, like this, there'll be thousands and thousands of document in the real time. If you go to the Airtel call center, they will have thousands and thousands of document, right? Whenever a call comes, the user, the case, the service agent opens the case. This is the case which we registered. Lenovo tab not working. Case number 1028. You can see that priority high. Case owner is Rupam, right? I can go ahead. Here you see there's a solution. I will just type a keyword called no and I press enter on the keyboard. System will give me two documents. No display, right? No display, right? I got no response on Lenovo tab. Is it in a draft status? Okay, anyhow, I'm an admin, no? So admin will give everything, right? You can see that with the keyword called no, system is, right? You see, reviewed, there are two solutions. No display, no power. Unreviewed, there is a one solution. Because I'm an admin, it's showing. But for users, this will not be shown. Unreviewed one will not be shown. Because this is not yet reviewed. This has not yet been certified by the admin, whether it's a correct solution or not. Right? User can click on select or he can click on the solution. No display. He can go ahead and he can watch the videos. Right. Finally, if it works, he will say select. Automatically, this solution is selected in the case. I'm back to my case. Lenovo tab not working. I use the solution called no display. Again, I will type no. I'll press enter. I will go ahead with no power. I will try this following steps. There's a document. I'll just click on it. Right. Go back. I'll click on view. System will open the viewer to show me the document. By looking at the document, I will keep guiding the customer. Right? I'll keep guiding the customer. Right? I don't know anything. Whatever the document is saying, I'm going blindly by document one by one step. Finally, looks like that it worked. The phone turn on. I'll say select. To resolve this problem, Lenovo tab not working. I have used how many solution? Two solutions, you can see that. Two solutions. Two solutions I've used. Not working. I click on close case. I will say status closed. Reason, others, internal comments, right? Problem fixed. And I will say save. Right? The status of this case has moved to closed. You can see that. Closed. How I closed it? With the help of these solutions. Two solutions I used. Now let's assume that I got one more case. I'm registering a new case. New case. What is that? Who is calling you? I will say. Right, Ram Charan from Tollywood calling. Automatic apps, as soon as I select Ram Charan, system will select Tollywood. I'm registering a case. What type of case it is? Others. What is the case origin, right? What is the case? I'm taking others. Case origin, by phone. Priority, high. Status, working. Product, see the difference. I don't have a web here. Web email, web, nothing is there. There also I create a new create case here also I'm creating a new case in lightning you have web web email web phone but here there is no web directly the product which product our product is not listed Lenovo TAM that means we have to connect our product here I will say subject what is the subject right I will say right unable to log in unable to log in to SFTC 
right blah 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 customer says i paid the fee you know right to join the course i joined the course received the tab right i followed the instruction provided by rupam but still i am not able to log so all these things blah 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 right so our counselors whoever is receiving the call will first try to did you created the account yes uh, did you got an option to activate yes you got an option to activate okay did you activated it uh, yes did you give the password yes uh, what it saying whether the password is incorrect did you try to reset the password all these things our internal people tried i will say okay let me register a case and rupam will get back to you the trainer will get back to you send a notification save right looks like that ramcharan doesn't have an email address by the way contact has an invalid or missing email address woof i'm opening the contact in another page ramcharan doesn't have any email if i'm not wrong see ramcharan what is his email blank ramcharan at the rate ramcharan.com i click on save now i close it i come here i say now i check it i click on save there is email system has sent an email to ramcharan now solution now right i i i look for a solution login l o g i n i press enter i don't find any solution with login no solution available for login no solution bad luck what i will do go back to the case i somehow resolve the problem now i will say close the case case closed problem others issue resolved now i know that today i am facing this problem there is no document available right i will go ahead and i will say right see i am creating a user is submitting a solution right use reset password password and reset the password what wait for 24 hours hours and then login then login right these are the steps to resolve if somebody comes and say unable to log in sales force these are the steps i am submitting a document to my admin because for this particular case i didn't find any document i'll just save case is closed one solution has been submitted which is in review status which is in draft status you can see that draft status not even reviewed draft here's that lenovo and unless and until the admin reviews it oh somebody submitted it right who submitted can be seen here right the admin see here it is created by rupam it's showing you the solution flow and it is been it is been approved by someone else it will show everything finally i went ahead and i said reviewed or i'll say it's a duplicate already there is a another solution same available i will say save only for internal right is that created status changed from draft to review now this document is available for public in the sense within my office employees if i check that external public then if i have did a programming and i have created a page where i can take this information and put it in that my home page then this information will also be available in my home page how to create a case and how to resolve the case we create register a case we resolve the case using solution questions anybody has any questions yeah mr rupam so actually uh, basically the uh, solution art architect must be i mean reviewing the so solution right correct. using admin correct. right yeah. correct okay not admin right hmm. admin has complete right in the profile there is a checkbox called as solution you have corresponding checkboxes in solution who can review the solution who 
right review solution solution review check who whichever profile you give a solution review reviewer they can only review it other otherwise others can only submit it will be draft status clear it's not that if you know i have to give an admin permission to everyone no right admin is the highest permission i am not going to give you to the solution architect right or to the you know smes i'll create a profile called as right sme a profile all the senior call centers right agents who are taking calls for five years we have promoted to the next grade they're not taking calls they're the sme they're reviewing all the calls every day what is the any new problem coming up they're doing a research right and they are publishing a document similarly call center agents also you know resolving the problem and they find there is no document they will submit it and sme will review it clear yes, yes. thank you your work in real time is not to create the solution your work in the real time is to upload the solution the way i'm creating solution you know 11 12 13 14 like this in the real time there could be thousands right this is the title these are the steps paragraphs how can i load it rather than creating one by one how can i load it from an excel sheet they will send that these are the 30 solutions that was reviewed and approved can you please upload in the salesforce and assign it to uh reviewer rahul that ticket will be raised to you that what you have to do your work is not to review or not to create a solution to facilitate uploading of a solution is your work in the real time which we'll see right from tomorrow's class all your admin work starts actually from today only we can start clear guys yes everyone anybody has any questions how to create a case in salesforce how to resolve a case in salesforce now i switch to lightning in lightning i don't have solution nowhere it will come in the next release last release we got recycle bin last week last release we got recycle bin this one this was not available earlier similarly i type sol right i have a lightning bolt solution something but but that's not a solution that's something different lightning bolt solution blank window right see nothing getting started with lightning bolt that's nothing but it, it's a, it's empty space to create an app create the first one one app which we'll see later i don't have solution anywhere i have only cases i open the case 1026 can i see solution anywhere no no whatever you are doing closed right call created everything is coming here update calls history any type of text message that you are posting any status change you are doing problem fixed status closed 10 minute back right here you can see all the related information but i still don't see when i go to the related i don't see anything called as solution which solution i have selected solution is not available right solution see status to close rupam changed rupam closed it case is closed 447 the case is created 53 the case is closed how did he close it nobody knows right because i have used the document solution document solution document is not available here at this moment solution is not available in lightning so how do you resolve a case in lightning right how do you resolve a case in lightning right currently for the services those who are using solution they are still on classic companies using solution as a part of their project are still in classic they are in classic mode they have not yet migrated to lightning if i atel is using services model of salesforce with solutions then they are still in classic
clear understood yes yes anybody has any questions 50% understanding would be enough 50% understanding would be enough you don't if you are able to understand 50% here and there that's well and fine okay any other questions any questions okay looks like that everyone is good with it yeah one question yeah. came in his mind actually yeah. so the, the projects i mean the companies which are using lightning as of now they don't have anything for solution nothing no. yeah. they have custom solutions built uh -huh. custom development okay 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 that's good now where is the contract i didn't while registering a case we didn't have a warranty we didn't have you know on site service on site services right i need to go it's just like a call center calling and accepting case but service is not restricted to call center the service technician has to go on field he has to repair the product he has to come to those right so i click on view all where are the remaining service activities you can see that service appointment service resources service territories right now write down right you have written what elements what are the elements you have written case solution contracts now write down card start continuing service appointment lightning service service resource lightning service territories lightning right now these are right work type lightning work type work type groups lightning these are all available in lightning but not in classic work work type service resources service territory service appointment right by the words itself you can understand these are for on site services whenever you want to handle on site services through salesforce then you need this following you have to have a service appointment whoever is going to on site he need to have some resource that means screwdriver right cut and player right a drill machine right you might not you might be getting 100 calls a day but you don't have 100 drill machines you have only 10 drill machines you have to plan your resources well right who will be taking the drill machine when if it's required or not all these has to be planned where do you service somebody calling me from the hyderabad outskirt 50 kilometers will you go that to to that location and you'll service service territories location where the servicing would be done work type what are the types of work you can divide number of works for example installation work right installation work fixing work cleaning work for cleaning work what are the machinery required who are the people for installation right what are the machines required right for example chimney fitting fitting cleaning requires right a non technical staff who can just come with acid and you will clean the chimney and he will go away but if it's required if it's requires a fixing then i require a technical team so you have to classify your works you have to classify your works works type then to perform that work you need a group of people you need a group of people right I, one person cannot perform let's say that it's an installation i need two people so you have to first create a work called installation work type and then create a group right all these are for on site services salesforce lightning also supports on site services whereas salesforce classic doesn't support on site services advantages and disadvantages salesforce classic support solution 
whereas Salesforce Lightning doesn't support isolation. See, at the disadvantage here. You need to then how did it been handled? As I told you, custom development. So in Lightning, they create their own knowledge based KB object and they start dumping as per the requirement. Right? As per the requirement. You can see. Right? All these now. To perform all these, for example, let's say that I create a work type. I can create a work type, not a problem. I say new work type. What is the work type? I will say, right, work type is cleaning, phone cleaning, tab, C L E A N I N G cleaning. This description, right, on site service to clean tab, clean, clean, T A B tab, I N T E R, interior circuit circuit and motherboard cleaning a tab right what time to what time right the service is open you can go ahead if somebody says can you come at night two o'clock no i can say right i will say service i will say gold service gold service Description, right? Gold India service, IND, gold, IND, India service. Right? Gold India service or India gold service, whatever you said, for gold customer. At what time zone you work? So this service, because it's a worldwide, anybody can use it. I will say, what is that? Four and a half hours plus five and a half hours GMT. I click on save. It is available gold service, India service only. What is the estimated hours? It will take two hours. Hours, days, minutes, two hours. Book time before appointment. Yes, appointment, before appointment. Right. What are these? These are very, actually, you can see that there's a lot of things are there. Right, information, very detailed. Right, block time before appointment. Block time before appointment block right so minimum you have to book it before five hours right or book time time before appointment before appointment what is the booking time right five hours minutes you can say right block time before unit right so i require it suppose i did a service at two hours right at two o'clock, I went to my customer's location, right? Again, after this, I have to go to another location. Can you book a slot immediately to, it will take two hours. That means four o'clock, I'll finish my work. Can you book another appointment at four o'clock? No, give one hour gap, block time before appointment. That means before appointment booking this, one hour will be blocked. That means if, Two o'clock, one appointment is there, right? Nobody can book it at one o'clock, right? There'll be a gap of one hour at least. Able to understand. Block time after appointment, after appointment, one hour. That means in every four hours, you can block an appointment. One hour before, one hour after. One hour for traveling, two hours for servicing the customer, one hour for again traveling back. So this service will take total four hours. Before the appointment, one hour. After the appointment, one hour. That one hour is for traveling, reaching the customer location, one hour. From there, coming back or going to another location, one hour. That means the service will take total four hours. What time the service starts? The service starts at morning, right? Time frame, time frame starts, right? Time frame, days, hours. We, we, we perform only on Monday, Tuesday, and Thursday only the service, then days. We perform from nine to five only, then hours, right? You can give units, time frame end. When time start from, this service is available from morning eight to evening six. So I will say hours, right? Six hours, 22 hours to 006 hours, night service, 
I can start training. I click on save. What I just created, I created a work time. I created a work time. You can see now you can create a new case from here. Whoever wants to book this. Complete details about this. This is a work, right? Related, right? Skill requirement. See that? To perform this cleaning, cleaning cannot be done by anyone. It requires a skill. Which service territory it's available? Who are the people who are there? You can see that. Only I will say new. Who are the person? I will say, right, I have to create a group. I have not yet created yet, one by one. Now, skills required. New. To perform a cleaning, what are the skills required? I require, right, what, to, what I require? I require electronic knowledge. Electronic knowledge anybody nobody can just go and open the tab and clean it no it these are the skill set required right for that again i have to create skill set it's it searching skill set required everything is linked guys searching i don't have we will we have to create skill level okay in skill level one to ten you can give anywhere intermediate no i require high this has to be high skill right intermediate high right once i enter this then only i can type here see cancel skill requires we have to first add the skills when i click on new i need to go ahead and find the skills required right similarly territory this service is available where outside hyderabad no within the hyderabad so i have to have a territory for that i have to create a territory everything is linked where is the service territory I can create a new one. I'm leaving. Similarly, work group member. Who are the people? Does it require two people? Yes. For the tap cleaning, one cleaner, one assistant. So you can start creating all this group member. I just created a work type called as tap cleaning. Once again, detailed services, guys. I'm going down and I say work type. I just created a work type. What is that work type? Tap cleaning. Estimated duration two hours. Like this, if your company is providing an on site service, you can start registering your services. Tap cleaning, boat cleaning, tab inspection, right? Uh, internet checking, whatever the services that you're providing. Like, done. Next, I created a services. View all. I scroll down. Next, work type. I will say new, new, right? What is this, right? New, right? I will go ahead and I will say, right? For that, I have to create a group. Okay, anyhow, fine, work, work, new work type group, right? I will say CLEA and a cleaning tab group, cleaning tab group, right? Team required to perform tab cleaning work right i will say right default group we have to create a group in admin currently just take it right okay right so available information right currently i don't see all this coming activated because we have to do a lot of admin work before we start doing all these things for now i said okay click save I have here I'll be able to see list of people right in the related right right in the related group member I will add who are the member whom whom you need right whom you need so it will show you the tap cleaning to us safe wait right see work type group members so here whenever you are booking it along with that the one the work that we created it's also here new right let's let's see right so for cleaning you might require something else also along with cleaning i require let's say that uh, shouldering team so you can add it multiple work you can add right multiple work you can add right tap cleaning inside the tap right you have created this tap cleaning right 
cleaning tab group right inside that you can start adding little confusion guys but if you just understand the basic that's enough because this is not your work in the real time any type of documents they have to follow yes while tab cleaning these are the documents required circuit diagrams where is that circuit diagrams i am giving a complete resource to my team right whoever goes right all the tab related circuit diagrams i can go ahead and i can attach here circuit diagrams so i will just take now i you know what is this uh, existing document i am taking okay here is a circuit diagram add not adding from the so this is the circuit diagram any approval require we'll talk about it before going there it needs approval right manager has to approve then only the service team will go to the location so approval history all these are group related right work type work type group collection one or more work type forms a group tap cleaning tap shouldering right let's say that uh, network check right i have a different different team right uh, connection pole team they will come with a ladder because they will have to climb on the poles so maybe i need that also those all will create in work type collection of work type makes group group that means to resolve that problem you need what are the works we need we need to make sure that we need electrician we need electronics cleaning we need a shouldering three type of work has to be done cleaning tap group you can create start right i mean app manager view all i'm scrolling down right next right right next what we have created next i will say service resource service resource service resource i click on new right i click on new now you see that what are the resources you need people we have added that we need this this this, this machineries you can add machineries in work type also drill machine these all now i will say name i will say that this is right electrician electrician name of the resource electrician who is the user currently there is only one employee i am taking myself only what type of resource it is it's a technician right it's a crew it's a agent it's a planner right he is a technician description blah 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 i click on save like this each and every person you will add here whoever is going to on site right active yes this person is available active if you are not making it active you can't pull them in the right here assign skills again the same thing what are the skill set available currently i didn't create any skill set so for electrician these are the following skill set assign service territories we have not yet created any territories let's go ahead and do that i click on app manager try view all right all these are interlinked you can create anything anywhere i will say service territories service territories where do you perform your service click new i am creating service territory what is that i will say hydrav hyderabad location right what is a parent territory for that right i have to have tomorrow's class territory management right in in admin there is a concept called as territory management there we have a territory territories we will create a territory chart right hyderabad hyderabad is divided into dishnagar right dishnagar kokatpally housing board right uppal right vikarabad so your organization doing business where it has to come from territory remember that currently i don't have any territory i can quickly create one territory called as right hyd rabad hyderabad again it's asking parent territory no right this territory works only in india timings you can say that active yes address right territory address this covers this is this, this covers a pin code right 50000 pin code one one territory i click on save i am creating a territory you can see that hyderabad operating hours it should take automatically actually as soon as you enter the territory it should take active yes new territory i have created click on save these are the locations where we can provide services 
we provide services in hyderabad location right territories you can add map area map right you can create child territory in the hyderabad you can start creating child territory called Dishnagar, Uppal, GD Mitla, Hard, Jubilee Hills, Banjara Hills, Madhapur, Gachiboli. You can start creating, right? You can start creating new child territories inside the Hyderabad, right? If if a, if an, somebody calls that, hey, I'm calling from, you know, let's say that I'm calling from Sangaradi. I'm Sangaradi, Hyderabad. You'll open the Hyderabad location and you'll say, do you have any child territory called Sangaradi? No. Sorry, we don't service there. We service only in the 16 territories of Hyderabad only locations. There is a child. You can start adding child. Same thing. Again, now you can start giving one one place name called right KPHB Kukatpali Housing Board. Kukatpali Housing Board might have a different operating hours. Right? High Tech City works from 8 to 9, 10, night 10, whereas Kukatpali works from 8 to 6 only. You can create different different time zones for each one of them. What is the Kukatpali you know, service area office? If you have all these things, we'll save it. Child, I'm creating say child territories. Who are the territory members, right? Rupam is handling. Who are the territory members, right? Electrician Rupam in this territory. He is the primary, yes. His address, phone, everything. I'm adding people to this territory, right? Territory type, what's missing? Date, right? Start date. So this is valid from first 12 p.m. to end date, right? This resource, from when to when this resource is available? This resource is available for one year. Maybe you might have taken a contractual, you hired a technician in a contractual for one year contract. So that's it. This is available from, right? Oh, why 2009? Sorry. From 2020 till 2021, this resource is available. This resource is available. Save. See? It generate ID, SMT001, electrician, primary is available. From this state onwards, this technician will be available in Kokatpali area, in Hyderabad area. Not in Kokatpali, Hyderabad area. He can service anywhere in Hyderabad. We hired in a contract basis. You can see that assign service resources. What are the service resources you created? Electrician, right? Already done. So any to him i will add right he is the electrician i hired to this electrician i will add a helper the way i created a resource called electrician let's say that this is a chief electrician i will say it edit what type of resource it is so he's electrician so i have to create all those to him i can assign one more person assign service resource Currently, I have only one user, so I only repeating myself, right? So you can assign to this person, there are three people who needs all these for Hyderabad location, electricians, these are the people, everything you can start maintaining here. All these things you can start maintaining in service resources. Finally, when you have the service resource, you have a service territories, you have all the work defined, now I have a service appointment. Service appointment. Click new service appointment. It will ask you who is service appointment? Who is calling? Saif Ali Khan. What is the duration? Right. Description. Right. You can go ahead. Right. Earliest date you can see. Okay. We can provide you earliest permitted date. It's going in September by default. Right. August 3 right one month maybe according to my resources and everything right earliest you can say that due date you have to complete the service by fifth right all the customer address right status scheduled in progress none i will say that it's scheduled not completed subject right tab servicing table tab s e r v i c i n g servicing right t a v tab s e r v I see ING. Tap servicing. What type of work? Work type tap cleaning. See the one which we created. Tap cleaning. Right? Schedule window window. Right? When arrival start when? So he will come in tomorrow at 12. Right? He will right. You can see that end. He will come by 12 o'clock. He will go tomorrow by 
not 12 by 4. Actually, I have to write a rule. As soon as I select tap cleaning, if you say 12, immediately it will change to here by two hours. Right? Schedule starts arrival. So before one hour here to start. So one o'clock. All these will be automatically picked up actually. 12 p.m. No. So I will say 11 a.m. He has to start by 11 a.m. 11 a.m. Schedule start. Schedule ends by 5 p.m. Not 12. By 5, 5 p.m. Currently, no validation. You can put any date time. It will not give you any error. No rules, no validations, nothing. Right? 5 p.m. Actually, what these are all you are saying. 12 o'clock, he'll come to your location. 11 o'clock, he'll start. 12 o'clock, he will arrive. He will perform his duty by 4 o'clock. And the whole schedule, end-to-end -end schedule start at 11. It ends at 5. But actual, what time he went? We promised 12. The service agent reached at 1 o'clock. So actual time, right? His phone number, whoever is going, agent phone number, agent email, right? Sorry, not agent. It's a contact. Contact additional phone numbers. Saifili Khan's additional phone number, email, I click on save, right? Parent record, okay. So let's say that he belongs to Bollywood, right? Click on save. Error on the page, anything else we missed? So that arrival start must be earlier. Arrival start must be earlier than arrival end window. So that I'm saying 4 a.m. It's 4 p.m. Not a.m. 4 p.m. 4 p.m. Click save. Next, same error anywhere. Arrival, arrival, what is that? Window, window start must be earlier than end. Okay, see it's third, ah, fourth. How can you start on fourth and end on third? Obviously, right? These all are, has to be automatically set, guys, based on the this tap servicing if I select. If you select 12, automatically this all time has to come automatically. Now I click on save, system saves it. One appointment has been booked. One service appointment. One service appointment has been booked. Now the agent calls the customer. Hey, sir, I'm calling, I'm on the way. That will be logged here. Right, your service appointment number is SA001. Your service appointment number is SA001. It's scheduled. Arrival start window 12. You have to start, right? You can see that. Once he goes, he can go ahead and you can say actual start, actual end. Right, he can go. When it's done, he can go in and you can say complete it. After the service is over, he can change the status to complete. Cannot complete. I cannot go due to COVID-19 situation, right? In progress, dispatched, right? It has been, dis right? Any dispatch is used, two things. Either the part has been sent or, right? Or an additional resources or alternative resources has been sent. Scheduled, dispatch, in progress, not completed, completed. He will change to completed status. He'll click on save, right? Service request completed, right? Related, right? What are the assigned resources? He can go ahead and you can assign some resources to him, right? Assigned resources, find the resources. Electrician has to be assigned to this, see? Right, it's a required resource, mandate, safe. Even though I closed it, but you can go ahead and you can add resources, more resources. Electrician, I require a technician, I require assistance. So to service this, these are the people required. This is how the end user goes ahead and perform on-site services. Whatever I gave you, work, work type, work type group, right? Service territory, service territory, service request, all these are for on-site, remember this. On-site services, all these, whatever you said, work type, work type group, service resource, service appointment, service territories. These are for, right? These are for on-site services, what the Salesforce is offering. Salesforce 
on site services salesforce on site services clear guys anybody has any questions yes think about an on site technician right coming to you sometime one will come sometime two will come right if it's a vehicle servicing two people might come right how to when they come you need to create some you know jumpers a toolkit all those you will put where you will put under work type under the work type you will define right tap cleaning resources everything type of work resources required in work everything you will define here clear questions yes guys able to understand yes or no yes a little too much actually but yeah, yeah it's not the basic flow but see it's it's little too much i understood that because uh, i went one after one after one after one right i do understand that right so first it's not that which one i have to create first you can create anything first mostly you have to create a work type first when you create a work type then only you can create a work type group service territory is individual you can create it any time it's not that you can start with service territory where i am servicing location all the location based information where your service team can go is captured here right all your service resources right people here is the people people here is the people here is only label to tap, to clean a tab to clean a tab right what are the things i require resources are nothing but people people with skill set you will add and then finally you will add those to your service appointment you will add those to your service appointment in the service appointment you will go ahead and you will add you will add all the related information when what completed everything you will go and add here understand that's it you don't need to you know break your head on this right this is not your work in the real time this is just end user work i'm showing right starting we were quite slow right i was going very slow in the starting because that was first time in the sales force now you are hands on on the sales force and this is not our focus area where we should be spending good amount of time right so hence just understand the flow that's enough check it once today if you are able to perform well and fine or just leave it nobody is going to ask in the interview what is a case how do you resolve a case no i don't resolve a case in real time but i am not an user i am a developer why should i resolve a case right i handle tickets i have a separate tool right hence these all are end user work that we have seen tomorrow onwards we will start your work admin work guys your work tomorrow onwards we will start your work admin work so don't miss the classes because first admin class will start from tomorrow where we will see how to create users user management how to create a user user management complete user management option we will see okay that's it for today if you have a questions please raise any questions hi rupam vijaya here yeah tell me yeah actually i joined uh, very late uh, for this course so i was going through the old recordings mm -hmm. and uh, started practicing here i have a i got a doubt like uh, mm -hmm. we can able to create uh, a leads campaign and account uh, these contacts these things mm -hmm. there these can be created from uh, service as well as marketing everywhere so, because in service also you require a customer in sales also you require a customer right in marketing also you want to require a customer yes. right so it will be available everywhere it's same okay so there is no difference if we create a no from difference. service or if no difference it's finally marketing. it's the customer master it's a master okay. table which will be called in everywhere wherever you you want to 
right for example here i want to have a service appointment for whom you can see bollywood right if you see saif ali khan from where it came i need a customer here you raise the order you need a customer you raise the opportunity you need a customer so they are called customer master they are available in all the modules and they are same there is no difference between whether you create from a uh, service module or sales module or marketing module or view all anywhere any other questions yes um, shubham uh, yesterday i tried to um, um, add the product to opportunity and i changed the price of that product uh, in the price book but that price was not reflected in the opportunity is it by default or Because, also... by yeah. default so oh, okay. once you add a product and later you change the price of a product uh -huh. right, the product price doesn't reflect yeah the product price doesn't reflect right it's not a life change right the product price doesn't reflect for example why there's a business reason for that there's a, there's a, there's a particular reason now i sold the product to you today right at mm. 700 right tomorrow you change the price to 1000 right you already committed the customer for 700 for that opportunity oh. how can you go and tell the customer saying that no sir you have to pay 1000 you say hey man you you told 700 yesterday oh, and yeah. no sir i see in the system called 1000 now so that's the reason once a product get added to an opportunity but if you add a new product it will show 1000 new opportunity mm -hmm. but existing product will show the old price only because this is how the business works every right. business works in that way right yeah so okay, thank you right anything else any other doubt now practice your end user work all the screens that you see whichever screen you want to go right don't spend much time just overview overall you understood how the flow happens how the sales force flow happens you have observed you are very good enough now to go ahead and start your real work these are the works that we did was completely to understand the flow of sales force you are not going to put anything of these in the resume right not a single point that we did here you will put in the resume whatever we start doing from tomorrow will be our core work core work so that's exactly what we'll be placing in our resume so don't miss the classes from tomorrow make sure that you are there on time i see that some of you are joining little late right so please make sure that you are on time right that's it for today thank you no homeworks you can create your cases you can create a solution right by yourself and you can proceed right thank you guys have a nice and wonderful day bye bye thank, thank, you. You. thank you thank you thank you, thank you. Yeah.